Uh, excuse me, sir. Hi, my name is Zachary. I'm with the Crested Butte Film Tribe. Some friends and I came out and carpooled from Crested Butte, Colorado today to find out why the 99% have turned out. We saw you earlier giving out food and, uh, and juice to people. Can you tell us a little bit about why you're here? Well, sure. My name's Roger. I'm a campus chaplain up at Boulder, Colorado at the university up there. And I just wrote a blog just today. I posted it about why Christians need to be a part of this. It's, it's, these are our people. We're the people in our pews. We're, we're in this together. And the fact of the matter is the police, the authorities, they're in this, whether they know it or not. We're all a paycheck or an injury away from being in the same boat. So let's wake up and, and join forces and sh get the, the rudder righted so the ship can be turned around and, and get back on track. Uh, my hope actually is to uh, do two things today. I wanted to, to provide some grace, some free water and juice and stuff to police and protesters both, just to remind everybody that we're all, we're all sort of like having communion together. We're all in together. And, uh, but I also want to sort of present a global perspective, a bigger picture beyond the national. So even if all the reforms that we want to get passed, which makes sense, the whole ultimatums of the uh, Wall, uh, the Wall Street uh, occupation, if all of those were, were, were somehow enacted, it would still be a challenge because we would still be 5% of the world's population in the U.S. consuming over a third of the world's natural resources, and all we've done is rearrange the deck chairs of one ship and haven't taken care of the other. So I want to remind us of a larger perspective that there's a bigger sense of justice and injustice, and we need to be a part of that too.